we're here. Hello, welcome back to DMWF Blast. And with me today, as always, is Webby. What's going on, everybody? Glad to be here yet again. All right, let's start this match, shall we? Or start the show. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Do you like this one? I do. Mm hmm. I found this after I was looking for other things. Oh, snap. <clears throat> Where are we tonight, John? I don't know. <laughs> Lord only knows. Lord only knows. That's right. It'll say in a second. We are from Columbus, Ohio. Just down the road from where AEW Dynamite is taking place as we speak. It's a packed crowd tonight, John. It is. It is indeed. We get this wonderful thing. All right. Cool. So awesome. So with that, we're going to uh, switch. So, so what's that? I was just going to say, so what do we got in the line there for uh, tonight there, right. John? I know we got a couple contender... Uh, choosing type matches to see to determine who's going to be in the future elimination chamber at the next pay-per-view that is correct so we have kurt versus chris in the, our opening match uh which is basically just a grudge match coming out of the uh, rumble last week uh we have our first fatal four-way which is a qualifier the winner gets a place in the elimination chamber at built to destroy uh, next up after that is a uh, uh, is our tag team title match between the Hosers and Midnight Thoughts. Uh, then we get a uh, mm, well, we'll get to that in a bit. We have Man. a triple thread match, also a qualifier for the Elimination Chamber, and then it's Phoenix and Goose, and then we will finish off with our main event, which is a title match. Coming off of two weeks ago when Ross beat Avalos in a non-title affair. And they are going to go head-to-head -to, -head to see who can hold the championship and who will go into the Elimination Chamber as champion. Now, I will say this, John. Avalos has held the championship the last several weeks. Mm -hmm. But Ross, going into this matchup, is undefeated as of yet. That is correct. If you don't include the Royal Rumble, which I don't. Yeah, um, I don't either. Yeah, he's definitely undefeated. So it's excitement. It's excitement time. There we go. So I don't know if you guys want me to read this or not. So I'm just going to nah, let the now. viewers let the viewers read. All right. Cool. Sounds good to me. So there you go, everybody. Uh, the unprofessionals have gained one other person, and I hear rumors they've added a fourth. We don't know who it is yet, but we may still find out tonight. All Listen, right. what can I say, John? We're recruiting. We're kind of a big deal. <laughs> All right, with that, let's get underway, shall we? Bow, bow, down, down, down. All right, so who you got in this match, Kurt or Chris? Oh, going into this match, uh, after the Royal Rumble, I'm I'm gonna I, I want I, I I think Kurt's got this. I think Kurt's got this. Uh, yeah, he just doesn't need to be knocked out of the ring. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. As long as he doesn't get counted out or stay too long outside ring. Um, but I mean, Chris had that really rough mm. Royal Rumble elimination last week. He so, did, so he can uh, be banged up. Yeah, I mean, he was power bombed by me outside the ring, so. Yeah, so we'll have to see how it all goes now. All right, so. Garbage? Kurt, I'm rooting for you. <laughs> like, why is that garbage? Wait, what did we do here? Did I end up? Okay. No, you just have to hit accept. Okay. Just worried that I'd all of a sudden become a player. Not having my feet get <laughs> pulled out from under me. Yeah, there you go. I mean, you did last the longest of anybody in the ring, so. Well, that's because he was pissed off from losing his match earlier. This is true. 
This is true. He lasted, the by the way, everyone, 10 minutes. Making his way to the ring from North Carolina, weighing in at Actually went in time bit. The Chosen One, Christopher. Ooh, the Chosen One. Okay, so Very dapper looking. Fancy, I, fancy I, outfit. I will say when he takes his jacket off, he does remind me of like a poker dealer on an old steam river boat. Yep, yep. Definitely has that effect, I will agree. Massive delay, Kurt says. <clears throat> Dandy, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so we're seeing. Oh, I like that. I like that little entrance there. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, John. Follow. Thank you for the follow, Kurt. It also might be a, a delay because I'm also commenting on things that I'm watching on John's Twitch channel and not on the stream that he's sharing with me. Watch it on the stream, you. I, I am. I am. I'm oh, sorry. Oh my goodness. By the way, I've played with a few of your entrances, so they will be quite and fancy. Oh yeah, do I get pyro? You do, indeed. In oh snap. I have also played Mad with some Dog. of the finishers and things like that to kind of make them a little bit better. I will say I am on YouTube and on the internet lighting bonfires, so I'm a I mean, bit of a pyromaniac. It is appropriate, yes. I'm gonna smack that hipster smile off his face. That's what Kurt's comments earlier today. Kurt, go for the back. His back is probably still sore from getting eliminated from the Royal Rumble. That's all I got to say. This can be interesting. I think this is Chris's first Man, singles match, I think. Yep, that does sound correct. Uh, I don't even care what Chris's finishing move is. I have to call it something like the Royal Flush or something. It has to be card <laughs> game related in some fashion. He just has that appearance. <laughs> yes, booed. All right, here we go. Uh, that's fine. I mean, makes sense. Ooh, ooh. Oh, some stiff right jabs, man. Yeah. But uh, Kurt's already on him. I think my sound's up a little loud. I don't know why. It's kind of annoying. Oh, oh. No. Stiff kicks to the back. Well, that's one thing Chris apparently can do is Pier 6 Brawl. Hmm. Big old elbow drop to the lower back. That's not going to make you have a happy day. Can Kurt turn this around? Oof. Big, oh, big boot. Jeez. Big boot to the face. <laughs> Chris's finisher is the monologue. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's, that's pretty that's good. That's pretty good, yeah. Subtle subtle hints towards a certain, certain character. Yep. Actually, we might leave that for a certain character should he appear. I'm not saying, I'm just saying. Oh, I really like that full Nelson uh, mm -hmm. turnbuckle head slam move. It's That's pretty fun, good. yeah. Let him. Trying to get the crowd motivated, but of course, he's a heel, so why would they cheer for him? Oh, big kick to the face. So I was hearing rumors in the back that uh, Chris may have found a tag team partner. Uh oh, yeah, we'll see if mm. it comes to fruition. But uh, yeah, that's what I hear. Oh, not even a one count. No, Chris has got to do a much better job if he's going to get anywhere against Kurt. Chris does seem to be a bit more of the brawler type as opposed to Kurt's technical wrestling. Yeah, I think uh, one thing... I'd say technical, then he just starts throwing punches. <laughs> well, I think he's a, he's a bit of a mixed mixed artist of uh, a variety of fashions as opposed to what appears to be Chris's one-size-fits-all approach. Big reversal there. Looks like a suplex. Oh, nope, reverse. Nope. Oh, he's got him up. Is this a go to sleep? No. Oh, wow. Pin. Those moves I don't two. know the name of. Yeah, I don't oh. know the name of that one either. Going in for the Boston Crab. Yep. Squeezes on. 
Oh no, this is the camel clutch, not the Boston Crab. Oh yeah, crab. yeah, this is cra Craftsman Clutch. Don't, get, don't <laughs> yeah, correct me, Kurt. That's right, yeah, it is. Heaven forbid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, another kick this time to the uh, leg. He's attacking the back. Oh, big elbow. You almost had your finisher, yeah. Kurt is looking rough. Chris is, uh, oh, reverse. This might be a yeah. chance for Kurt. Kurt. Kurt's gonna have to turn this around. Yeah, he's gonna have to now, again. Is Chris, is Chris also a heel? Uh, you know what, they might be. I don't actually know, to be honest. Getting a lot of these heel, that tells me a lot about the DMWF is just it's full of heels because we get all, so many of these heel versus heel fights. Well, I did switch them around a bit to kind of take some of them out. It might be a problem if I hit the wrong thing, so I'll, I'll double check. Some of the characters are heels just because of other reasons. Man, you do have leg, Kurt. Yeah, Kurt might need his refresh. Sometimes I've noticed that helps. Oh, here's a big old... Big swing. Yeah, big helicopter swing. That's what it's called. Uh, wow, he's got Chris thrashed. Okay, here's another pin. One, two. Oh. 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 And a, this is awesome, Chent, coming from the crowd. Holy mackerel. Big kick. Is he going to go for it again? Yep. Smash He's targeting the hands. Probably looking for a submission finisher, I guess. Oh, misses with the swing there. Big old punch. Oh. Uh oh. Mm. I think we saw that move in the Royal Rumble. We did, indeed. Yep. And he's Chris setting up for his finisher. This it, might be the end of it. This might be. Oh. Is that your finisher option of choice, Webby? Three. Three. Oh, wow. Chris my. pulls it off. Hurt. That's two, my friend. Two. <laughs> I don't want to start shit this week, John. <laughs> Who's the jobber now, Kurt? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I was rooting for you this match. Yeah, so was I. I, I, I think I think you're holding up for bigger and better things. Yeah. That's all it is. Yeah. Got to get into the chamber. I really thought you had him toast when you did this one. I love that the crowd actually cheered. This is awesome. So close. That finisher, though. That's devastating. That's your, uh, what, your what did winner, you call it earlier? Oh, I have no idea what I called that earlier. I don't know what to call that now. Oh, oh. you mean the Royal Flush. Yeah, there you go. <clears throat> Look at how happy he is. He is, he is very upset with the crowd. Well, they're booing um, him. Wouldn't you be unhappy? Yeah, well, you know, he should be a face then. <laughs> <clears throat> Next match coming up. All right, so with that, we get into our first qualifying match. Fatal four-way. Going into this match, John, who, who who do you think has the upper hand in this match? Well, based on the fact that he won the qualifying match for the number one contender in the pay-per-view, I would give it to uh, to Rob. Me too, because of that creepy-ass nightmare <laughs> smile. I almost gave another character one of those smiles. Actually, another Don't Rob character. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't we, we actually found a creepier look for for a trip that would have included a really weird smile. But uh, we, we went for menacing over that option. All right. I will say that B, when she stays within the rules, might have a good chance. Right. That was trash, though. Uh, but we'll see. I We haven't seen B or Fox in singles competition in this particular version so we'll have to see Kurt I will say you as a character are growing and developing because that match you stayed in the ring there you go so you actually you got, got that going for you and hey you didn't do what Goose did in the championship match losing 30 seconds well basically <laughs> get one kick in 
and then spend the rest of the match getting your butt handed to you and be done in less than a minute. Yeah, pretty much. I don't know why I would it target the hand. I don't one know of either, the actually. shortest matches. It was the I've shortest match of the night by far, and yeah, it was one yep. of the shortest I've ever seen. Not quite like Kofi versus Barack 18 seconds, but yeah, it wasn't good. No. Uh, we'll see how this one goes. I'm curious to see. Oh, I always forget I need to do stuff. I kind of get sitting here like it's a video, and I kind of forget I have to interact periodically. All right, now you get to see a few new entrances. I am going to change the video here. Over the next little while, you'll see some changes when it comes to that, too. You will also notice I've changed the name of this character to Anthony, no longer called Astonis. Making his way to the ring. This, I think, would be my second pick coming into this match. I was very impressed with all of uh, Anthony's wrestling. Magic one. Magic one. I had to reboot my iPad. Oh, right. Fair enough. It is a bit of a pain. Happens to me too, Kurt, occasionally, so. Watching matches and all of a sudden it's like, oh, I'm talking and that person isn't responding for ages. Ah, this might be why. I will say whatever you're doing differently this week, John, your mm -hmm. stream is not lagging in the slightest yet. Awesome. Uh, the difference was I got rid of the hard drive that was causing my computer issues. Oh, all right. Yep. Yeah, I had a hard drive crash last week. So I think that happened like the next day, actually. So it should be running a lot smoother. There she is, the beautiful bee. Well, who also is hated, just that way. Yeah, yeah, because everyone's a freaking <laughs> heel in this organization. Anthony's not. He's a. He was cheered when he came out. Thank you. Yeah, he's like one of four people. No, you are. Your entire posse are cheered. Thank you. I know. I know. That's because we're faces. We're not the bad guys. <laughs> uh, all the hentai on the hard drive. No, just hard drive. No good. I hate hard disk drives. I've switched to all SSD now. Solid state or bust. Here he comes. And from Connecticut. Shaking Whoa. his money maker. You'd rather be a heel Whoa. than a face. Yeah, you know, it's easier to be a heel, I think. Oh, don't get me wrong. I think. Webby I would, would start off would as a, a face, and I'd, 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 I'd very quickly make my way to heal. <laughs> oh, I got rid of your B, by the way. Oh, yeah? You gave me just a normal letter? Nope, I gave you something else. Oh, all right. You'll like it. I went a different way because I looked at the Bs that I could use, and they didn't really work. So I figured I'd get it away from being the Boston Red Sox hat. Well, seeing as though I never wear any of my Boston Red Sox hats... That's probably for the best. Fair enough. I do I do own them. Okay. But... I did it one time as well, to be honest with you. Although I don't think I weared it. Weared it? I don't think I wore it a lot. I think it was after they won the first championship. Nope. Because I think everybody was, like, cheering for them that time, unless you're from New York. Nowadays, it seems very hard and to be a heel. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, proper Weed heel, I will agree, other than MJF. Pounds, the professor. <laughs> that walk. I know. I know. Uh, I don't think that's new, but it looks weird. Maybe it's because we didn't see his entrance. He had his entrance with Cat last time. <clears throat> okay. I have no idea which character this is taken from. He's, he's well, weird. he wagged his tail and <laughs> everything did, at the yeah. end. He's he just looked like an eager dog he ready did. for its owner to be home from work. Like, yep. That's pretty much. All right. And now he's the Gray Power Ranger. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I blame you for that. That Bob Backlund. Uh, but it's not because I didn't have that option. Unless it was a generic one. That could have been. Oh, they're not liking this. 
They must really hate B because she's the only heel in this bunch. Oh, big kick from Rob. Standing. Big knee from B. Yep. Wow. Who is going to come out of this match? The two favorites in my eyes are both the ones standing at the moment. So Anthony's getting his butt handed to him again. When he did a squat block. Okay. No, they're both out. Fox is now in the firing line. Rob's got him. Looking to set him on the top rope. What's he going to do? Tree of woe. Oh. Oh. Oh, big back. Kind of a code breaker type thing. Which Kurt will correct me on, I'm sure. Big punches by Anthony. Nice flip. Gets B down. Doing what you have to do when you're the smallest competitor. You just take their wheels out from under them. Oh, now he's looking to do something with B. He seems a little confused. Oh, oh what okay. is he doing? Uh, that was weird. Uh, oh, Edquist thrown to the outside. Oh, it's a pinning situation? No, not yet. Here we go, push into the Big corner. Big drop kick. Oh, he misses a drop kick on B. Second. Oh, she gets a back heel on him. Outside, Fox and Rob are fighting. Oop. Anthony reverses. Nice back heel of his own. Drop kick to the face. Powerbomb to Rob on the outside. Oh, we got a submission move. Mm. Ow, that would hurt. And Anthony going for the pin. One, not even a two. Rob back in now with Fox and taking it to him and pushing his way through the other two competitors. Oh, now it's B's turn to get knocked out of the ring, it looks like. Oh! Sunset flip, power ball. of the ring. Quite the combination. Can Rob make the pin while these two are fighting outside? I am very impressed with Anthony's wrestling. Yeah, he's doing quite well. Oh, B back in, but still unconscious, more or less. Fox reversing that one. Oh, Anthony goes for a huge oh, big elbow, elbow. Fox going for the pin. <laughs> Fox trying to steal the pin. Anthony Sneaky Fox. Stops that. Now it's Fox and Anthony. Oh, a roll. Oh, I thought he was going for the roll. Oh, ouch. Goes for a quick kick there. I'm out. Yeah, exactly. One, two. Oh, close, but no cigar. Maybe you should try B, but this is on Fox. Rob tries to get involved. Now aiming for B, who just barely got to her feet. I don't think that's going to end well for B. No, it did not. There's a pin. Oh, Anthony breaks it up. And a big standing big drop, drop kick. kick. Oof. So Rob's all alone. And Everybody else Anthony is down. Rolls to the outside. B has not been able to get to her feet on her own for quite some time. He's going to go for the pin. Nope. Fox coming back into the ring. Yep. Yep. Oh. <laughs> and whatever, whatever that, was, that move was, that was something. Now Look. Beast to the outside. Yep. Fox is down, but Anthony now comes in to break that up. There's a big old oh. move. Oh, Fox leaping. Let's put a stop to that. B trying. Oh, I was about to say, trying to get her first offense in for a while. Does not last. Uh oh. The crowd is enjoying that one. Um, pause. Uh oh. Uh, well, Anthony's still trying to do something. Um, they're all. Just give it a second. Yeah, just give it a second. Rob's coming back in. That might help out. Oh, there we go. Yep, as soon as Rob got in, it all straightened out. I think Fox just forgot how to count. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, neckbreaker. 
Oh, her Corona. That was definitely a glitch. Yeah, Rob's kick was insane. Oof. And there goes Anthony out of the ring. B, who got at least a couple moves in there, is now... Oh, struggling. Oh, ref. Uh-oh. Uh... Okay, everyone's just taking a breather. Yeah, we had a bit of a stutter there. I'm a bit worried that that was uh, the game kind of struggling. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Rob missed his cue. Oh, pinning combination. Is this it? No, Fox oh. breaks it up. Oh. Mm. I don't think B's quite as good without Phoenix. Yeah, that corner glitch is bad. That's the second time we've had a corner issue. Oh, what there we go. What was that move? <laughs> B breaks it up. Rob out on the outside now. B down again. Fox down. Anthony's the only one standing. Rob's trying to struggle to get to his feet. Anthony. Oh, Same move. oh. nope, Reverse not this, this time. time. Fox going for the pin. It's a sloppy one. Two. Oh. Ooh. Two and a half. That was close there, John. That was very close. Now Rob trying to get a cheeky interruption here. Power slam. Does he got him? Oh, power bomb Two. pin. Oh. Oh, oh it's oh, a... Into, a... into a Boston Crab. Yep. Oh, but B breaks that up. B back in. Brushing leg sweep. Yep, right side brushing leg sweep. Oof. Anthony putting the boots to Rob now. Trying to get the crowd hyped up. B just doing nothing. Oh, there's that move again. Oh, it's a B. pin. What? Who was pinning who at this time? <laughs> <laughs> I think the ref was counting Anthony. And the ref is out now. Yeah, he got caught up in this nonsense so B needs to pin somebody but nobody can count everybody's still down Fox is moving Rob's moving oh blood oh, for Anthony, Anthony Anthony is busted open yeah oh here's here comes the ref Fox trying to get Rob up in a suplex it looks like Folly. yes is he gonna go for the pin ooh another Russian leg sweep for B. <coughs> Anthony and B on the outside is probably not their best choice. Reversal by Rob. Anthony back in, but not on his own volition. Oh, and there's a Michigan Big driver. Big power bomb. He got out, though. Oh, Rob missed oh, the uh, break. Rob missed with the elbow. There we go. There, got him with the drop kick. Yep. Punches to B's back. Another couple to the head. Oh. Nice job. Suplex. Yep. B has to roll out and recover. Rob misses. Oh. Fox. Salida del Sol. Ah, right. Okay. So that weird move that Anthony does is called a Salida del Sol. Oh. Jesus. Oh, oh. Okay. Woof game is being glitchy this evening oh totally oh, missed. missed that high risk no reward yep no it's the game was stuttering there for a second it's got it's, it's back in it again Michinoku driver could not go for the pin because B broke it up before he had a chance she's trying to break it up again misses nope Oh, hits the referee trying to punch Rob. Going for suplex. Nope. Oh, it's a... What is that oh, move? I, that's a strange DDT. Yeah, I think it's a, a... Oof. Fox almost hit the referee. I don't know what Fox is doing at the moment. <laughs> Fox, Fox has rabies. Fox has rabies, folks. Oh, it's another move. Oh, spin out power bomb. Okay. And then going for the pin again, Fox has stopped that. So now it's B and Fox. 
kick to the Cavs. Can she do some damage? She misses with the drop kick. Meanwhile, Rob working on Anthony. Oh, goodness. Oh, another oh, attempted submission move. I don't think submission. you want to do that in these situations. Big head, but. Oh, B might pull this off. Yeah, everybody's no one's, down. No one's there. Here we go. One, two. She did it. Oh, Our first Anthony qualifier. I can't really call it an upset since I, she was one of the ones I predicted, but. Mm, poor Fox was on the receiving end of a lot of action for a bit there. Mm. Fox has rabies, folks. It's such a heated thing to say, exactly. <laughs> That was some amazing action. Here is your winner, beautiful B. The B gets her butt kicked the whole match, but still manages to qualify nonetheless. So one half of the British Union will be in the Elimination Chamber at Built to Destroy. I it will say Tamara's face slash makeup in this, in this event, uh, if 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 she was ever playing hockey against me and I stepped out on the ice, I'd immediately step back off the ice and just forfeit. <laughs> it bothers you that much, huh? Yep, tap out. There's Dave's new look. No more yellow and red blue. What was wrong with the yellow and blue? And Dave didn't like the color combination. Oh, all right. Everybody loves purple. I know. It seems to be like everybody's favorite color is purple. I know. So many heels. These guys are not heels. They are faces. I mean, they're getting really kind of a sure? mixed reaction, but they're supposed to be faces. You are correct, Kurt. They are Raven's colors. Specifically. Here they come. The hosers. The champs. You notice the distracto rama up there? Yeah, that's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Close as I can come to a, a WrestleMania sign. There they are, our winter duo. <laughs> dum, dum. All right, calm down there, John. <laughs> <laughs> I can change my color, Webby, if purple is too much. <laughs> oh, it's, it's not that purple's too much, Kurt. It's just like everybody I know wants purple. Like, I mean, that's Rob's favorite color. It's Tamara's, Tamara's wearing an awful color. lot of purple. Yep. I mean, just everybody has purple going on. I would like to show how I do not have purple going on. Thank you. I very specifically am actually wearing a combination of Canadian colors and Edmonton colors. Even though I'm from oh. Calgary, according to the game. The match is about to be underway for the Tag Team Championship. John, do I even have to ask who your favorite is going into this match? I mean... Dave uh, King Baker! Dave King the Baker! On the way to the ring. The Grim Reaper. At a combined weight of... This is, this is a very delayed. Why are they doing this now? I think it's because it's a championship match. The Grim Reaper. Uh, the, Grim the, Reaper. Ministry. the Ministry. That's right. Dave King oh, Sabrina's Baker. face paint. The Grim okay. Reaper and their opponents. There we go. At a combined weight of 444 pounds, they are the champions. The Brawler, Jonathan Williams. Yeah. And the Innovator, the Bad Guys. The Bad Guys. Thank you. <laughs> Just to avoid a repeat of that again. The new tag team champs, 
the referee. <laughs> nice. All right, here we go. Here we go. Okay, same two starting out again. Here we go. <laughs> so let's see if this time we get a different result, maybe. I.e. a finished match. All right. Dave's working away on me. Tosses me into the corner. Bag of potatoes there. Oh, bit of an eye rake reversal. Kick to the face. Punch oh, this. Big cut place. punch. <clears throat> Avalos doesn't want to fight Ross. Nice. Ooh. Pancake. Ouch. All right. Dave's got his opportunity. Let's see what happens. Can he make this title change? Now we know in the last attempt, John never did get into his own corner, but he is this time and he's tagged in Tamara. See already the restart is in the, the hoser's favor. Yep. I mean, they are dirty cheaters, so you know. <laughs> I like this day better. <laughs> Well, I did too, but not so much now. Can Tamara get yet another submission? I watched that back. That was a very weird because the referee had waved off the submission and then he called you submitted. It was very strange. Kick to the gut. Oh, oh. Another camel clutch. Different pair of competitors, but same result. Quick punch to the back. Oh. So now. Can Tamara. Oh! Reversed Your by Dave. Uppercut. A few kicks to the uh, thighs. Oh, she's going to go for a lift? That's not your best choice. I'm just saying. Ooh. Oh, had the opportunity, but he got out of the ring. Oh, and just because of that, he got back control. Oh. <laughs> well, okay. That was a move. That was quite the headbutt, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> devastating headbutt. Uh... It's like a puppy dog or a cat bumping up against their master. Ooh. That, however, was not. One. Two. Ooh. Only a two count on the t half the tag champs. Oh, here we go. Tag out to Sabrina? Yes. Oh, I thought Dave was going to try to climb the turnbuckle. I was going to be like, no, don't do that. <laughs> no high-risk maneuver, please. Oh, here we go. She got the squeeze on, big ol' oh the yeah, the junkyard dog, you're right. That that's sort of that is sort of his move, isn't it? Brings her up to the feet. Tamara with a big reversal and a big old European uppercut to go with it. And again. <laughs> nope, game is not skipping. Here we go. Tamara is back out. Brawler in. Can he do it? There's a quick little DDT. He's gonna take advantage of this point. Although, Earth. <laughs> I mean, you know, this game, you kind of have to. Oh. 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 What? What was all of that? <laughs> that was a big move. Big spinning move. I thought for a second I had her in a. Then it uh, switched on me. Oh, here we go again. Ouch. Oh, goes for the pin. Two. Mm, kicks out. That was close. Well, is Sabrina going to take the brawler? She's, she's working up that signature move again. Oh, but and again. And again reversed. Yeah. Just having a heck of a time trying to get that in. Double arm DDT. Ouch. Here we go. Pinning. One. 
two. No. Didn't think Sabrina would get pinned so easily, especially if Dave was going to do nothing. Okay, throws her into the corner. Is he going to tag out? Oh, well, he might have, but... Oh, and Tamara takes a cheap shot. Sabrina wobbly pop. Goodness. But the brawler has not recovered. He's going to get thrown into the opposite corner. Into the ref. <laughs> I'd like to think that John ran into that ref intentionally. I mean, he probably did, not going to lie. Throws Sabrina back into the other corner. Tags his partner. Here Going we go. Double team move. This is definitely a signature move here now. Ooh. Okay, she's crawling. Tamara's in. Oh, reversal. Kick to Big the drop chest. Kick. Oh, does it look choppy? Sorry, guys. Oh, yeah, it was a little bumpy there. I can see the stream's been bumpy. Hopefully it clears up. Oh, big, big move. Ugh. Double back body drop. Well, hopefully it's clearing up. No, it seems to be flashing. Hopefully it doesn't stay like this. Okay, I'm going to record the rest of this match. Oh, oh. Okay, hopefully it clears up, guys. Sorry about that. Okay, thrown into the corner. Dave is in trouble. Is Tamara going to tag out, or are we going to get another one of these situations? Uh-oh. Oh. oh. She, she's giving him the death soul stare. <laughs> yep. I guess she was waiting for him to move. Nice T-bone suplex. I would have tagged out myself, but, you know, that's just me. My partner has different ideas, apparently. Throws Dave back into the corner. It seems to have cleared up now, Kurt, so hopefully if you do refresh, it'll fix itself. It was struggling there for a bit. Big kicks. They got him pinned. She tags herself in. And they're just basically trading boots to the stomach. My goodness. Here we go again. Oh, nope. Different move this time. Oh, flashy. Dave's up. Oh, and he turns oh, it around. Oh, Dave is angry. Dave yep. is angry. He is tired of being stomped on. Yeah, the game does the zoom thing. It does, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, he didn't appreciate that. Big comeback. Ooh. Over the shoulder. I think I know what the problem is. I'll fix it in a second, hopefully. Because I've noticed the uh, game is running a little slowly. But it could be because it's on a windowed mode for some silly reason. Okay, hang on. Okay. Another headbutt. Oh. Sorry, just one second. I just want to see if I can fix this or if I have to wait till after the match. Oh, I might have to actually fix it after the match. So we're kind of stuck with slow poke mode. Okay, maybe that'll fix that problem. New day corner move. Ah, right. One. Two. Oh. Two. Oh. That was close. Okay, what are you going to do, Dave? Pumping the crowd up. Oh, it looks like he's going to go for a patented maneuver. Trying to get the crowd riled up. I think he's spending too much time pumping up this crowd. Yep. And he misses reversed immediately. Oh. <laughs> the Canadian stampede. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> Ooh. Reverse into a suplex. Okay. Can... Oh, maybe if I do that. Right. Here comes a double team maneuver here. Oh. That looks like a finisher if I've seen one. Can she do it? Sabrina going for the count. Tamara coming in. 
Breaks it up oh, just barely. Just in the nick of time. Oh, Dave hit Sabrina. Almost hit the referee. Got Tamara though. And he's giving a nice cuddle to the referee. <laughs> the referee is just like, well, hi, Dave. Oh, no! Ooh. Referee is magic. Uh-oh, Dave is he's down. He's currently yelling at Dave for being <laughs> in the ring. <laughs> Not paying attention to what John is doing. Oh, stomping, stomping on, on that hand. Mm, the brawler is choking the... him out. Oh, my goodness. I don't even know who the legal person is right now. I believe it's me and Sabrina, but I couldn't tell you for sure. Yeah, he is rolling out, so. Ooh, big punch to the face. Dave is down outside of the ring. So if they go for a pit now, Man, there's no one to save him. Here it is. One, two. Oh, she kicks out. <laughs> How did the ref not get kicked? I know, right? All right. John's trying to get himself psyched up now. Will the brawler be able to put the boots and finally finish off Sabrina? Stomping on that hand again. Yep. Apparently that must be key to something, but I don't know what it is. Throws Sabrina into the corner. Is he going to go for the tag? Nope. The crowd is very unhappy with the hosers at this point. Wake up, Dave! Yeah. <laughs> mm. Sabrina is down. Dave's getting up. Is he going to get there in time? No! That was oh, close. Two count. That was so close. I thought that was three. Dave is back up. And he's back up in his corner. Okay. Oof. Brawler's pretty much had his way with Sabrina for a while now. Is he going to be able to... Uh, finish this off or is he going to tag in his partner throws her into the opposite corner oh what's he setting her up for is this another tree at nope it's not it's a one wing angel it's the one wing angel he's going for his finisher there it is he's got to come up with a better name he's got to come up with a better name <laughs> shut up that's the actual name for it one yeah you got to come up with the original name Three! Uh, Dave didn't even attempt to rescue his tag team partner in this match. No. And the Hosers regain their first they tag team defense. They retain the championship. <laughs> oh, she comes in and gives Dave another boot. Kicks him out of the arena. The rink. Now they're going ham on Sabrina. Oh, my goodness. What is this? Well... Looks to me like you might have the beginnings of a rivalry or something going on. Yeah, just throws them out like a bag of potatoes. Holy cow. Dave, are you going to take that from these Canadians? I know, right? Wow. That was quite, you the, hurt me. quite the aftermath. <laughs> Goodness gracious. So, yeah, we are, we are their enemy. Oh, hell no. <laughs> That's right, he could have, but he didn't. So Webby has things to say. Apparently, uh, listen, I, I, I do not control. There you go, check that out. What happens? Oh, I like the panda hat. There you go, I think you'd like that. Now, if this promo is anything like the other promos that we've seen so far, I apologize ahead of time. Because <laughs> so far, as of yet, they have not been great. No, that's true. There we go. All right, let's see what he has to say, shall we? I like my PS3 2K16 because it do a lot of team moves in the ring. Mm. Here he is. What is he saying? He's says we've all been asking me on you've all been asking me on social media and on wwe.com when i'm going to come out to address what's been going on i can't turn my phone on without someone member of the universe asking me a question well you wanted me and now you've got me 
I mean, you could read this. It is you. Uh, yeah, for whatever reason, my graphics, like the stream that I'm watching you on, mm -hmm. just went all blurry. Like, I can oh. see it, but I can't. Perfect timing. All right, so I'll keep reading then. Um, I'll play Webby. Yeah, I'm going to stop watching you real quick and then sure. turn it back on. You know, there's this chump who's been going around telling everyone that he's the best in the business, that he's even better than me. It would almost be cute if it wasn't so damn annoying. This does sound like a Webby. Uh, it'll be behind. Once it pops up, it's going to be delayed. Yeah. I want you to know that I can see the future. I see a superstar who thinks he's better than me. I also see a hospital bed. And now I see me introducing the two with my fist. I must be psychic. Let's get Austin out here and see if we can't make this future happen right now. Hey. Boom. Nice. This is actually a good promo. It's almost like you. Oh, Austin has a promo performance too? Yeah, apparently. Who do you think you are, sucker? I don't know. No, Kurt, regardless of what you might think, me and you don't we don't have beef yet, alright? <laughs> here we go. But this but this horse man right here. Uh-huh. Alright. Okay, I'm gonna read Austin's promo whenever he says it, and it'll be way ahead. There's no better feeling than walking down that ramp, getting that amazing response from the universe. Hope you all came ready for a showdown because that man right there and I have some unfinished business that needs tending to. And it's going down right here, right now. I appreciate you coming out here wanting to air whatever grievance it is that you have with me, but I was just about to make a few de declarations of my own to the fans. I hope you don't mind, but I'm going back to what I was doing. <laughs> hey, buddy. Chump. I'm Austin. I like horses. Enough said. I wrote this <laughs> poem especially for you. Would you like to hear it? Probably not. Let me read it anyway. Ahem. <laughs> God. Who is a superstar interrupting me? It's a perennial contender or a future champion. I don't have an answer. I don't have a rhyme. I missed the last sentence. Oh, dear. Look, I get it. You want to make a name for yourself around here. You're trying to do that at the expense at the expense of one of the greatest natural-born athletes the WWF has ever seen. I hate to break it to you, but it's not going to happen. What's going to happen is I'll set your career back to the Stone Age. You really don't get it, do you? The universe, does this guy have any clue who he's messing with? Damn right he doesn't. If he did, he'd be running the other way, like the coward he is. But it's too late for that now, because I want you inside this ring one on <laughs> one. I don't know if you realize this, but it takes more than a big mouth to make it in the DMWF. And while you might have the biggest mouth on the block, you don't have what it takes to go the distance. So why don't you go backstage and pet your horse? <laughs> Love it. Nope, there's a lot of pointing going on. Oh, a headbutt! Webby, not happy. Oh, he knows he messed up now, son. Oh, here we go. Oh, we go right into a mat. There's no referee. Nope. He's just brawling. I also don't hear any crowd. Nope, nothing. It's just you guys punching it out. Oh, man, it is very strange. There's no... Yeah, there's no crowd, no nothing. Oh. There's no crowd. There's no ref. Nope. Oh. Hmm. <clears throat> Oh, man. Nope. I don't know what that was, but it wasn't much. Well, he just... He won. And roll out. Roll in. Roll out. Roll in. Where, roll where out. Are you going? What? Oh, man. Listen. <laughs> you. One of us chooses to stay where we got to go. So, you're scheduled for a backstage brawl, so I kind of wonder if what, this is what we've gotten into anyway. Oh. Oh, are we, are we going to be working our way back there? That's what I wonder. <laughs> 
Yep, no crowd. We just have to be the crowd. Oh, nope. Oh, here's the referee. Oh, he appears all of a sudden. Oh, all right. Okay, they're going oh, to break, to break it up. up. Okay, that'll actually kind of work with the next match happening backstage. Oh. That was quick. Like last time. Probably because it doesn't have to bring in the crowd. Oh, here he is, walking backstage. After that brouhaha, there's Webby. He's trying to be friends. I don't think so. Nope. Oh. Oh. Oh, and there is no padding backstage, folks. Nope. Oh, that was a fun oh, headbutt. Big headbutt. They're right by the locker room door. Oh, Ooh. Missed with that. Elbows to the stomach. Another one. Webby trying to gain an advantage. Oh, he gets thrown over. Oh. Crowd's now paying attention now that we're not in the yeah. area. Oh. Big combinations there. Is he going to throw him into something even more dangerous? It looks like it. Oh, no. Oh, I thought he might go for that electrical box. I did too. Oh, look, there's Fox off in the background. Where's Yo, that? Fox, get over look, here. Is that Fox? I don't know who that is. I, it that's looks a like random Fox, wrestler, possibly. Except for he's got a chest open, so that's why I don't think it's Fox. I don't know who it is. Austin with a lot of reversals. Yep. Elbow to the face. Ouch. Okay. Webby now dragging Austin. Where are they going? Oh, elbows to the stomach. Another elbow to the stomach. Oh, that was loud enough. Webby made a noise. Don't usually hear them saying much of anything. Oh, I just love the wrestler in the background. Just Yeah, doing he's doing a promo. Like, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Come on. Oh, there they see him. Now they see him. I don't know who that is, by the way. We're just doing a whole lot of, like, headlock, walk this way, here's yeah. some elbows. I think, I think he's trying to drag him out to the parking lot is what's happening to him here. Oh, ouch, into the wall. Grab that fire extinguisher. <laughs> Put him through the table. Do something interesting. <laughs> Webby's like, stay down. Oh. No, it's just a pure six for all so far. Oh, into the door. Oh. Oh, over it goes. That's not a door. That's a stage piece of some sort. Oh! Into the stone wall. Yep, into the corner of the arena. Oh, look, it's... There's another there. wrestler in the background. <laughs> it's a bunch of raw wrestlers. I don't quite understand, but whatever. Oh! Oh. I guess they can't change the uh, superstars that they put in positions around here. Yeah. Another monitor. Oh, this is the promo area, of course. That's, yeah. That's what it is. So they're smashing into monitors. Hmm. Ouch. Back in his head on that concrete slash mat. We'll say this. This is not how I thought this, thought would, this go? would go. No, I know. Oh, oh, series of punches to the head. This rivalry is just getting started. Oh. Hmm. It's another Samoan drop. I don't know if they go for a pin or what happens. Because there's no referee that I can see. Chair, I know. Oh. Well. <laughs> yeah, they brought all the way to a WWE show, yeah. Austin is not horsing around, and he was. Oh, Austin. I don't, yeah, I don't understand how the, like, I don't, I guess it's just, you have to inflict enough damage. To I guess you knock him out. Where... It's basically like a, uh, a, uh, last man standing sort of thing. All right. Man, this is only going to cause more, this, this, more bloodshed, more of a feud to come next week. This rivalry will continue. All right. Meanwhile, we're back in the arena. We actually have a triple threat match 
for the second qualifier position for the Elimination Chamber. Oh, I see Devin looks different. Yeah, I worked on him a bit. Did you work on him with Devin? No, I talked to, well, I showed oh. Devin what I had been doing and asked him for his input on color schemes and he said, nah, leave it, so. Gotcha. So Devin, Cat, and Ember going at it for the second position. We have a total of five positions that are basically being fought over and the winners of each of these matches will enter the chamber. I was going to say, two two of those positions are going to get filled tonight. Yep. Right. Yeah, the two will be filled next week, and the final one will be the week following, just before the pay-per-view. All right. Or should I say the event? Making his way to the ring. Here comes Cat. From the fifth dimension, weighing in at 189 pounds, the lunatic. I need to fix the fact that they're getting booed. I think that might be my fault. I may have actually pushed a slider the wrong way. My Devon character has good hair. Has the good hair. Oh, okay. You gave him Goku hair. Okay. I tried to go for somewhat realistic. She's so very slow. Fox was so fast. Fox was an eager little beaver yeah. to get into the ring. This cat's careful. But she does have a fantastic entry. All right. Next up. Comes. Weighing in at 276 All pounds, right, so. Big Nasty Devin. Who you got and why, Webby? Oh, I'm rooting for my boy. I mean, I knew that was coming. I know you're rooting. Love the jacket. Hey. See, the green blends well with that. I will say he looks a little bit more Devon-y now. A little less uh, black vampire. Uh. And there's Ender. From Washington, weighing in at also 185 pounds, the unpredictable... <laughs> I don't understand some of these people, for sure. <laughs> it, she kind of reminds me of Vince McMahon's chicken walk thing. Zen Master. There you go. His, his finisher is called the Zen Master. I like it. You need to write these down, Kirk, because I'll never remember. All right. Here we go. So, Webby's got Devin. I gotta admit, I kinda favor him in this match as well, but Cat is one of those very aggressive types who might be able to take the advantage on this triple threat match. Remember, with triple threat and all of these matches, there is no disqualifications and no count outs. So anything could go. However, we did notice in the uh, four way, none of that went. Oh, Cat comes in quick. Spear right off the bat. Yeah. This cat has claws. Oh. oh! Amber striking back quickly. Close line to Devin. Oh, yeah, Webby, remember your panda slam. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I didn't get the panda slam Austin in the, in the back, though. No, that's true. Actually, you didn't get a whole lot of offense in after the first. No, I didn't. The heel. It's okay. Next next week, John, I want another I want another rematch. What a and surprise. I want, to, I want to choose my match. Uh-huh. Oh. 
right, well, we'll talk about that after this episode, then. All right, Ember with the uh, advantage, but then Cat just comes straight back and flips her over. Oh, and then Devin returns the favor to Cat. Oh, Ember's out of the ring. Oh. This is a perfect opportunity for Devin. Oh. Oof. Yeah, that, I gotta change that. That's not how that's supposed to be going. Yeah, but the Panda Slam. I don't know if you want to do that to Austin. <laughs> I think he does. I think he does. Oh, going for the quick pin. Oh, oh no, I remember, Kurt. Don't worry. Oh, arm bar. Is she going to get it? She can't get it locked in. Oh, reversed. Mm. Oh, punches to the side of the head. For whatever reason, em Ember's character just like something about the outfit just screams like Saturday morning cartoons. Like she looks like a cartoon character to me. I mean, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh. Oh, and tossed out. Cat getting aggressive. Oh, saw Devin trying to move. Goes after the pin. Could Cat get the pin here? No, not even close. No. Devin's got to get moving here. He hasn't done very much so far. Referee actually moves this time. Cat trying a submission maneuver doesn't make a lot of sense. I'm just going to say Ember catches her out. Devin now with the opportunity, but the reversal. Oof. She's a kid's next door. Yeah, she is kind of that type. Yep. Oh, it's a. Uh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, she's going for the figure eight. She's going for the figure eight. And she got him. No, he gets out. Mm. Cat didn't do anything like I thought she would. She's going for a spear or what? Nope. Ugh. Number 75. Oh, there's a spear. Amber has been in control. Probably the one person I did not expect to be in control in this match. But Devin's finally starting to take some of the match back now. Oh, here we go again with some corner head smashing. Oh, over she goes. Ember trying to get up to her feet. Devin looking to put a signature move or a finishing move on. Is it a go to sleep? Nope. Oh, but then runs right into a big old spear. Cat, one, oh, Cat capitalizing two. on Devin's move. Oh, oh, that was close. Oh, she's going for a high risk maneuver here. To the top rope she goes. She's turning around. It's a... 450. Hmm. One. Nope. Ember's fighting back quite well so far. Devin's finally up to his feet. Oh, this is not a good idea. Cat trying to go for another high risk maneuver and stomps on Ember. Stomps. Denver. Devin does nothing to stop that. And Devin's now down. Cat is just too quick. Yep. She is. That was not a moon. Great zone, ring either. control. Mm. Mm. Oh, look out. It's looking like she's going to do. Oh, a crazy move as caught Devin. Here we go. What? Nope. Misses by Cat. Er, er. Cat now in trouble. Amber's got Devin already down and Cat about to be down. Mm. Yeah, okay, 450 the forward spin. Okay, fair enough. Two. Oh, Cat barely kicks out at two and a half. She's trying to get out of the ring. Mm. She's getting to her feet. Dazed. 
Ember missed on the punch. Is she waiting for her to do something? Nope. Devin in for the backdrop. Hmm. Sidewalk slam. Sidewalk slam, sorry. <clears throat> well, those lines. Oh, he, Devin going for one of his own. She jumps at him and gets him. One, two. Would Amber be yet another upset should she win this match? <clears throat> this whole night has been a night of upsets, John. <laughs> Here we go. Even the Kurt, even the Kurt match, I rooted for Kurt and he lost. <laughs> well, I wouldn't say the hosers winning was an upset as such. That was an upset. <laughs> oh. The hosers winning. Dave was very upset. Kurt was very upset. I was very upset. I didn't say you weren't upset. Was, I'm just saying it's not. It a, was an upset. They, they were the champions. It's not an upset if they win. Two. Oh. I would say it would be kind of awkward if Devin went on to the elimination chamber, won the championship, and then I had to fight him for it. I know, right? That would be Devin coming back. Ooh, he's got it locked in. Oh, but reversal. Amber taking her time. Oh, bulldog. Nice bulldog. Old school. Yep. Amber kick to the stomach. Mm, Devin going down. And mm, combination flip. She got him. Is One, that enough? Two. Th oh, oh, that was that awful was close. close. That was awful close. If Ember can do yet yeah, another signature or finisher, she might have him. Oh, she got him in a wheelbarrow. Ugh. Devin is in trouble. Going forward twice in a row. Ugh. Cat's back up, though. Yep. That'll probably be what saves Devin from a pin right there. Although Ember is doing a number, looking like she's trying to get ready to do yet another figure eight. Oh, Cat fights back, though. Cat goes for Devin. She might be able to do this. Oh. That's. Is it? Oh, no. I don't know oh, what's happening. Did it. Devin Cat. taps out to Cat. Cat did it. Oh, my word. And Cat's moving on to the Elimination Chamber to fight for the championship. What a submission. Oh, my goodness. Wow. That was quite the match. I really actually was wondering if Ember was going to steal this one at one point. But Cat, that plucky underdog, kept coming back. Hmm. Devin just didn't really have it in this match. He got an advantage on a couple of occasions, but just never could follow up. Listen, Devin had a rough week, okay? He he went into this match not following his own life advice. Okay. <laughs> Cat arch. Here is your winner. Cat's meow, I like that. There she is. The next qualifier joining B in the elimination chamber. Is cat fifty thousand? Of course, he defends Devin. Typical. <laughs> <laughs> uh. All right, so now we are. Up. That's fine. You know who else I defend? Avalos, quite often. Well. I wasn't gonna say Avalos. No, nah, I know, but I was gonna say my my man Ross, who's fighting Avalos tonight for the championship. Yeah, but first up, it's your other man Goose fighting Venus. My man, I I'm you know for, I can't root for anybody because everybody I seem to root for <laughs> loses. So heterosexual. What? <laughs> Devin is his heterosexual life. What? Wife, yeah, I think it's you're a trying Jane, to say. A, no, life mate. It's oh, okay. It's a Jane Silent Bob reference. Ah, I see. Okay. See, Kurt, I'm on the same page as you. 
So Avalos is going for Nicola. Nicola, the other half of our British Union. Making now can Goose pull Goose out a match that's longer than a minute? <laughs> Somehow, I don't think she's quite up to the same standard as Avalos, but we'll see. Best seats in the house, baby. That's right. There she is. Ready to rock and roll here. All right. Here we go. Here comes Goose. I just want to hear her say, Goose! Hey, yeah, Goose! <laughs> and his opponent from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 282 pounds, Goose! 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 <laughs> oh, that announcer. Hey, out. Golden Goose. All right, let's see if he can make a go of it. It's so weird with his glasses. It looks so funny. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah. I mean, other than the fact that he's milky white as all get out. All right, Goose. Can you make, can you pride you have in yourself make up for that mess from last week? Show, show something here, buddy. Walks like he's a prairie doggy. <laughs> mm. Neck breaker. Here we go. <laughs> Heard that made me chuckle like yeah. way more than it should have. <laughs> Working away now. Choking up on Phoenix. <clears throat> okay, Nicholas has got to get off the ground. This is not working in her benefit. It's an arm bar. Not locked in, though. Once again, that move has not worked out. Mm. Phoenix with the punches to the face. Oh, but then immediately it gets reversed again. But she flips I don't know him. what the quality is on, on the stream of mine here that I'm watching. Oh, is it really janky? Yeah. Mm. It was doing fine up until probably the, the latter half of the tag match. Mm. Here we go. Slaps to the chest. Punches to the face. Kicks. Oh. Oh, my. Got her up, pulls her back in. It's a suplex. Mm. Goose, 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 goose. That's right. Oh, Nicola avoids trouble. Yeah, I think that might be derivative of the fact that I'm streaming twice, effectively. Mm. Oh, uh-oh. This looks like a signature move right here. Mm. Butt dive. One, two. Oh, I was like, not again. Nope, she misses on that kick. He gets a knee lift up on her. Phoenix stumbling to her feet. Mm. His turn for a little pedigree. Oh, mm. my man. That's my signature move. Here we go. One, two. Oh, took a little too much time on that one. Oh. 
Nice pair of Corona. Takes him down. Another clothesline. Oh, misses on his clothesline. Super kick to Super the face. Super kick. Jeez. Kick to the gut. And a knee lift. Mm. To the chin. Oh, he's going for that choke maneuver again. Ooh. Standing suplex knocks Goose to the floor. Phoenix picked him up and with authority. Goose has got to turn this around. Yeah, Phoenix is uh, starting to make it work in her favor. Using her hair to uh, cover up Goose's face. <laughs> so much booing, I know. I think it's because they're both Don't worry, Raph, I'm on the chin, I'm on the chin. Let me just put this hair down over his throat. <laughs> yeah, so you can't see the choke. Hair that look more like streamers than hair, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my God. She's going to kill him if she keeps him in the move any longer. <laughs> Picks him up. Mm. Armbar. It's an armbar. Can she get it locked in or is Goose going to get out? No. Oh, oh my taps. goodness. So many submissions this evening. That is Goose. Got his Goose cooked. Not going well see, for Mr. See, yet again, everybody I seem to cheer for, I'm, I'm rooting <laughs> for, seems to be getting the uh, the short end of the six, stick, so to speak, John. Well, you know, I mean, I can't help it. That's the first time we've seen the armbar pay off. Yep. Mm. I thought the pedigree right there was it. I really did, because I'm like, that's a finishing maneuver. People don't generally tap out of it. Or get out of it. But is it his finishing move? No, is it, it is a signature not. Move? Yeah. I or is it not even a signature move for him? I don't think so. It might just be a regular move for him. Here is your winner. <laughs> Kurt says <laughs> stop cheering for him. Okay. Uh, so one half of the British Union. They both halves of the British Union, I should say, won this week. Wow. In singles competition. Yeah, but B's win gets her a spot at the Elimination Chamber. That's true. This is just a respect win for Phoenix. But she's going to go much more confident into her own qualification match. Here we go. Here we are, everyone. Main event time. <clears throat> we know Webby's got Ross. Who does... I don't want to say a thing. <laughs> okay. Webby has nobody. I will quote. Now, win or lose, I, I'm rooting for my boy Ross, the new, the newest recruit of the unprofessionals. Mm -hmm. I will say, we, uh, I, 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 I saw these two in a uh, match in an independent circuit, and. Uh, Avalos put a move on Ross that looked very painful, I'm just going to say. Here we go. Makes your tossing Chris out look actually kind of nice by comparison. Little the Mouse Ross better come out with a chair. One fall. One fall. Sorry. Da, 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 da. Ross Boyd, everybody. Our pirate king has come to center stage. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I don't know what the little chest pump thing is. Don't know. I'm not understanding that. Mm -hmm. 
Watch out, he plays dirty. Uh-huh. Gonna say, Avalos had a very good match at the pay-per-view, beating up on Goose. So, he will be very confident going into this match. <laughs> All right, just for that, Avalos, with a little comment on Discord. I, You know what? I'm throwing my full support behind Ross on this match. <laughs> Did he call you out? All right. Look at all them fans. Happy to see him. Now, here we go. Here he comes. Our champion. I don't think I've changed his name yet, so I think it still says champ when, he <laughs> when it announces him. There he is, wearing his belt. Oh, I need to change that. It says championship. It should say champion. Oh. Alrighty. Heading to the ring. Had three... Well... One successful title defense so far. Can he notch up a second one? Of course, Avalos won the championship <clears throat> on the first official episode of Blast capturing the uh, gold in a six-man ladder match. Introducing the yep. challenger from Which Ed Quist also almost won. It's true. Uh, it was very close. It was. Ross Boyd. The Captain Ross Boyd. Introducing the champion from your darkest fears. Weighing in at 332 pounds, he is the world's heavyweight champion, the champ. <laughs> yeah, it still says the champ. Looks like another Twilight reject. Oh, dear. All right, here we go. It's for the gold. The new champion, the referee. He's winning all the titles tonight. <laughs> yep, title match after the regular show after February. To be fair to Ross, he won a non-title match, so. Oh. And whoever wins this goes to Elimination Chamber as the champion. Ross is one of our smaller competitors, just so y'all know. I think the only one shorter than him is Cap. <clears throat> Some massive head smashes in the corner there. He's trying to do a silly move. Oh, oh pinioned, and now punch is raining down on Ross. Ross is going to have to get off get the champion off his feet if he's going to win this match. Oh. Avalos. Alligator roll around. across the ring. Yep. Now he's got him in a uh, sleeper. I think. Hard to tell when you can only see the back. <laughs> Kurt says so much better than Goose already. <laughs> yeah, he got some offense in. A uh, little bit more. Oh. Axe handle to the face. Put the boots to him. Oh, looks like we're going to see another camel clutch. They like some things, just they are their favorite thing to do, I've noticed. Hmm. Ross tossed in the corner. Avalos got him. Oh, and now it's Ross's turn to kiss that turnbuckle. 
and Ross is on Dream Street. Avalos picking up Ross. Oof, punch to the back of the neck. Owie. What's he going to do with him? He's got him pinned against the ropes. I think he's going over. Oh, no. That's the last place Avalos wants to fight Ross is outside. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh! Oh, DDT to the ring. On the apron, the so-called hardest part of the ring. Punches raining down. An elbow to the face. More punches. This is actually not where Ross wants the champion. You can't win the belt out of the ring. Oh, he tosses oh. him back in. He gets in. He's wiser than than Kurt. <laughs> mm. Going for the hand. Probably for a submission hold later, I'm guessing. Oh, Ross going up to the top rope. He's going for a high-risk maneuver. Will it, will it pay off? Avalos is up. Oh, and down. down. Avalos is wobbly. He's against the ropes now. Is Ross going to try and put him out of the ring? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Big wow. Oh, bleep you. Hi, <laughs> Kurt. Um, nope. Sitting up. What's Ross going to do now? Oh, chokehold. Sleeper. He's trying to put him out. Is this going to be enough? I don't think so. Stranger things have happened. But I just don't think he's got enough positioning to actually put him down. Will the champ tap out to just a headlock? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, he's going to be out of this right now. Oh. Ow. Oh. Grip. Brutal slam. Yeah. Yeah. Throws in Ross into the corner. And again, greets him with the turnbuckle. Ten more slams. Ross dazed. Oh, but he still manages to get up. Oh. Oh! But a Samoan drop puts an end to that. Avalos using his size and strength to his advantage, as he should. Two. Oh, not enough. Avalos seems surprised. Ooh. Yeah, why wouldn't he be? This is the longest match he's had so far. <laughs> well, he's fought Ross Sorry, before, Ross. and Ross won, so he should know that. He knows he's going to have to do much more work to get him. He's setting up for his signature move here. Yep. Oh, he's got him. Oh, no, it got oh, reversed. reversed. Mm, but he can reversed roll out be. and avoid the pin. He's got time to recover while Ross has to come out to get him. Ross has to get him back into the ring, of course. Throwing some haymakers. Oh. Not giving Avalos time to, to catch his breath. Nope. He's going to slam him into the ring post. Ooh. Ross really needs to get him back in the ring. Yeah, this is not to his benefit at the end of the day. It's fine as long as he gets him back in. But as... Oh. Turned around by Avalos. Oh, dear. This is bad. Mm. All he has to do is just leave him there. No. Oh, he oh, cut him oh, open. Ross busted open. Oh, my goodness. Avalos is just going to keep him outside. Yeah, this could be a count out. Oh, he throws oh. him back in just in Avalos time. Avalos doesn't want to win that way. No. I think that's a mistake, personally. Throws him in the corner. Oh, immediate reversal. Could Ross come back and Big actually sneak line. this? Ross is seeing red. Yeah. Oh. oh! Now Avalos is busted open. This is a pay-per-view level match, everybody. Rocks him with a big punch to the head. Drops him with an axe handle. Bleeding and tired. Avalos kick to the forehead. That already bloody mess is worse now. I don't know what the crocodile thing does, but there you are. 
They're now their blood brothers. Oh, there you go. His rod, oh. oh, he's he's taking, the taking off the off. turnbuckle. That's dirty. As if being busted open wasn't bad enough. Yeah, if he gets him that turnbuckle, this is over. Oh, he's going for a recovery. He's resting. Avalos gaining momentum. Standing up. Ken, Ro Ken oh, Ross counter. Throws him in the other corner. Oh, but he misses. Ross got him. Oh. He's going for a powerbomb. Oh. It's a pin. Oh. One. Two. Two. Oh, oh, my goodness. Oh, he turns it into oh, a submission man. move. Can he keep it? Can he hold it? Is that what he's going to tap? Look at how big he is. Do we have a new champ? Not yet. Nope. nope, he turns it over. Oof, that was so close. Ross was within a whisker of taking this. I just think he was too big for Ross to get the submission that he wanted. Oh, no! Oh! Uh. Right into that exposed turnbuckle. This could be it. This should be it. By all rights, this has to be it. Oh, but he kicks him to the face. Another reversal. He needs to get him back on the inside. Oh, no, Avalos is going to do that himself. Oh, big move from oh, Avalos. Power bomb. Power Pin. bomb. This is it. One. This is, this is Two. It. Three. It's Three. over. Avalos wins. See, everybody I root for loses. <laughs> That was one hell of a match. That was amazing. Well done by the champion. He came to play. And it looks like there will be a sign of respect between the two of them. Look at that. There we go. Even with the exposed current buckle, there's still a level of respect for each of them. Well done, both of you boys. That was a great match. A great uh, match for someone in a non-pay-per-view environment. And that was, you can't say anything other than that was a hell of a match. Well done, both. And, uh, and then, yeah, I, no, next show. Yeah. So that is the end of Blast for this week. Thank you, everyone, for coming along. And uh, I hope you all will uh, return next week when we have yet another show a blast. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You can do that here, and you can watch the latest video up here. And if you want to know more about what we do, be sure to check out distractionsmedia.com.